Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make these single fourth bracelets. I'm calling these the single fourth bracelets because they are four single chains that look like they are together. So, you're going to need to have your boom set up, and here it is up close. And to make this bracelet, you're going to need to actually have a rainbow loom. Um, if you do not have a rainbow loom, then you cannot make this because this end does. Okay. This does sort of. This does sort of involve. Okay. Sorry about that. But. Let's see, so you're going to need to set up your loom, and this configuration, if I can get it correctly, and then the, um, right there. So you're going to need to have your loom set up like this to make this bracelet. To make this bracelet... You're going to need bands, of course, the loom, a hook, or you can use your finger, and bands. I'll be using rainbow loom mixed colored bands. And you're going to need to choose three pegs and across our three pegs. So we're going to be using six pegs today. And um, the colors I will be using are these tier the teal bands and I do have a little bit of mixed bands in the way um and with that mixed band in the way I will also be using mixed bands so it doesn't matter which color you have um this is what it looks like I use just rainbow colors so I just grab random rainbow colors and now let's get started if you're using colors two colors um if you want them to be next to each other it's three pins three pins so one color for, th for three of the pins so let's get started so the first thing you need to do is cross is cross this sorry is cross the band from here to there so that's what you should have so far and take another band and then do the same thing sorry let me just cross it now I'm very sorry if you were out of the camera but you're just crossing these and then take another band and it's kind of hard because my film stand broke this last fast week when I started making rainbow and bracelets it broke so I could barely use it so this is what you should have so far and then now here comes the easy part. You always want to place your bands going that direction. Oh, sorry. And then that direction. And then take another band and put it up like that. So you're only going to have two bands on per peg. So just grabbing the bottom one. And that's on the outside. So that is what you should have so far to make the single fourth. bracelet 
and then now you're gonna use your Sorry about that. And if you guys know where I can find like a new stand, definitely tell me. Okay. So, I'm sorry if this is really hard for you, but I'm going to find a way so that my camera will stand the way I want it. Ha! Huh, found the way. No, you're just... Crossing. And then, right there. So that's what you should have so far. Is this, you're just placing this, you're just placing a band from here. And then a blazing band from here and then here. And so you're just going to be looping the process. And you're always just grabbing the bottom band and putting it over and release. So yeah, it's just only the bottom bands. So I know I am completely not finished, but once you have some area that you can pull from... Make sure you pull. So, so now you have that, hopefully. And then, sorry, I'm sick. Because I had to film a video for you guys. So I'm going to show you guys how to take it off. So you're going to take this band, bring it right there. Bring this band and bring it across and then bring that band across like so and then you just do a sort of like a um a slip knot pattern like that and then whoops you just take it off and you guys should have something like this. So now I'm going to take one of your bands and pull it. Okay, let's redo that. So yeah, make sure you have all your bands on, otherwise that would happen. So when you put your three bands on, like that, and then, now, do it like that. Oh, and then now you can add your C clip to it. And so thanks you guys so much for watching. And if you guys definitely liked this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. And that's what it looks like. And then that's what the other one looks like. So I'm very sorry since you're out of the camera. Um, just to kind of show you guys. So you're going to use six pins. Place a band here to here then cross it place band here cross it to here to that band and then cross it from here a band from here to here a band from here to here and then a band from here to here and then always take the bottom put it over and you only want to have two bands on a time and if you guys want to learn how to make this bracelet it is different 
and then it has like a little fish tail going on and then on that side because this bracelet's not the same if you look at it like that and then it is totally different and then you have like the fish tail so i hope you guys like this video for other videos definitely click the link in the description box down below they'll take you to my instagram and so i hope you guys like this video and sorry i couldn't do a full video and sorry about the movement in the background but i'll definitely get that pit fixed and actually find a screen stand thank you guys so much for watching bye